In this video, Timmy's going to show you how to copy and paste on Android so that if you have words somewhere on your Android phone or tablet, you can very easily copy those words and then paste them in a different location rather than having to retype it all. So when you're on your Android phone with the words you want to copy, the words can be in pretty much any app you like. Timmy's got this email here that Timmy wants to copy, but you could be anywhere else. You just need to hold down on one of the words. So if you want to copy the word containing here, you don't necessarily have to just copy containing, but if that's one of the words you want to copy, you could hold down on that word with your finger like that, and you let go after a second or two. And now, as you can see, the word containing is highlighted. So now, if you wanted to just copy the word containing, you would tap copy in this menu that appears here, and now you've copied it. But if you wanted to copy more than the one word, you would hold down on containing to highlight that. And then you see these two little bubbles here, either side of the word, and you'll just need to drag those bubbles to make it highlight the rest of the text. So if you just wanted to highlight this entire sentence, you would drag this right hand bubble all the way to the right and down a bit to highlight all of that. And then you would drag this left hand bubble all the way to the left. And now that entire sentence is highlighted. So if you wanted to copy that sentence, you could tap copy here. Or if you wanted to copy several paragraphs, you could drag it down and highlight even more and then tap copy there. Or if you actually wanted to copy the entire email, you could do what Timmy just showed you and drag the dots to highlight the entire thing. Or there is a bit of an easier way. If you just hold down on one of the words again, you could tap select all and now it's highlighted the entire email. So now you could tap copy here and it would copy the entire email for you. So that's all there is to copying. And now all you need to do is go and paste it somewhere. So you'll just need to open up any place that you could type on your phone to paste it there. So Timmy's going to go into Google Keep, which is a note taking app. But you could be pasting this in a new email or a text message of some sorts or anything else you want. So when you've found the place you want to paste, you just need to tap where you can type to put your cursor there. And when the keyboard comes up, you might see above the keyboard here, there's this little icon here with a paste symbol and the beginning of what you copied. So that won't necessarily come up, but if it does, it can be really handy. All you need to do is tap this button and then whatever you copied will appear where your cursor was. So that can be really handy if it does come up. But if that option doesn't come up, which it hasn't come up now, don't worry. All you need to do is press and hold on the cursor for a second and let go. And then just tap on paste. And now you've pasted it that way. So if the button doesn't come up, you can paste like that. So that's all really cool. But one thing that often gets a bit confusing in copy and pasting is when you try to copy a text message that someone has sent you. And it is possible to copy a text message. It's just a bit different the way it works. So when you're in your text messages app, if you want to copy all of this message or some of this message, unfortunately, all you can do is actually copy all of the message and then delete the parts you don't want later. So if you hold down on it, you'll see you can't highlight any of the words like that. It just brings up a bunch of emojis. But if you tap on this copy button at the top of the screen here, that will copy the entire message that was highlighted. So now, you've copied this entire message. So if you wanted to copy the entire message, that's all good. And you could now go and paste it somewhere. But if you maybe didn't want the words sure and it's, and you just wanted the address that was in the message, what you would have to do is go back to the app where you wanted to paste the message. 
So come back here. And now, if you hold down and paste, it will give you the entire message. And then you would just need to tap in here and delete the parts you don't want. So it's not really that hard. It is pretty easy to copy it and paste it across. And sometimes you might actually find that your phone has worked it out for you. So as you know, we copied the text message, sure, it's and the address. And as you can see here, that button to me showed you before is above the keyboard. So you could tap that and paste the entire message. But Timmy's phone has actually figured out that the address inside the message is probably what Timmy wanted to copy. And it's put this little suggestion here showing Timmy this address. So your phone might not do this for you, but if it does manage to figure out what you want, what you want to copy, and it shows up here, you can just tap that and it will paste just what you want to copy without pasting the entire message and then you having to delete the words you don't want. So if it does that, that can be really handy as well. And that's all there is to it. You now know how to copy and paste on Android. But if you want to take a screenshot on your Android phone, you can learn how to do that in this video right here.